everyone, this is your boy Reggie Beats. I'm here with a major plug, man. You know, every time when I learn something new that is dope that can help out people out there, I'm always gonna share it. You know what I'm saying? Because you guys are my people, you're my subscribers, you like my content, you keep me moving and stuff, and I appreciate y'all for that. So I'm gonna keep on sharing the major plugs with you guys. You know, I mean, if you're a, a rapper, a producer, a sound engineer, event manager, band, you know, you can name it. As long as you're in the music industry, man, then you really need this. You gotta keep on watching this video. You know what I'm saying? So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, you know, ask any questions you wanna know. So I'll be showing you guys how to make your own websites for actually beat making. I'll be focusing on beat making. So as I said, it's a WordPress theme, you know, it's very simple to install WordPress. So I'm not gonna go through that step, you know what I'm saying? But unless if you want me to show you, just comment below. I'll be more than happy to show you. So it's like a WordPress theme is very simple. So all, all you gotta do is have the theme, you know, I'll, show, I'll, I'll put the link below when you wait to get the theme and everything. Don't worry. Now just watch as I go. So I have my theme already. You know, this WordPress like a very, it's, it's very simple. You just click and, you know, click things, read and click. So uh, I'm going to go to appearance and themes so I can load my new theme that I got from Sona. So I go to add new theme, upload theme. Okay, choose file. Also, I kind of do websites, you know, so if you need help with that, highlight me. Man Pro, HT Docs. I forgot what I named it. What did I name it? Sona, yeah. So, well, like when you get the download package, you get the, you get this file. You open up this file, and there's everything inside this file. You know, there's demo content. There's the theme. So I'm gonna go to the theme. You know, I'm gonna use this Sona zip. So they give you everything. You know, click open and install. It takes a while to install because I mean it's installing like a whole big website, you know. So you know, gotta be patient with it. And what I like about this is because there's steps also on their website. Okay, so it's done installing. Then you go to activate, activate the theme. Yeah, so now we got it is activated, man. Now our theme is in there. The thing is, before you actually go through with this, you gotta, you know, uh, organize, like install the plugins that are required. So go to click begin installing plugins. These are like all your normal WordPress steps. You know, you see this one's required, required, recommended. You know, let me just install all of them, the ones that are needed. So you just select all of them. You go to install, click up. Yeah, so now I have all my plugins updated. Now I gotta activate my theme, you know. Under your account, you'll be able to get the license keys from there. You know, I can't show you mine because, I mean, it's, it's private to me. But then, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll leave a link below and everything on how to get that key. Because even, like, after getting a subscription, you get everything there. You know, everything is right there. And as I said, that customer service is amazing, man. You can ask anything, they'll reply to you. So let me activate mine. So I go to theme options and I go to dashboard. So when this load, it should give me like a play store, man. Damn, my internet is very slow. Okay, right, there it is. You can hear it saying, uh, you know, uh, make sure you enter your license key. So I'm gonna enter my license key now. So I'm gonna paste it here. Then you demo content install. This might take a while, like you know. So now what you're gonna get, you're gonna get this whole website the way it is right now. Like it's you know, it's just perfect, it's perfectly set up for you. All you gotta do is just change the picture, change the wording, change the color. You can change almost everything because it's based on Elementor. Elementor or Elementor, I don't know what they call it. But this is like a page builder, you know, it works with almost a lot of WordPress plugins these days. It's very simple and it's very reliable. It just drag and drop. It makes everything simple for the guy doing the website. So click on install. You will install whatever, whatever, okay. Voila, look how it looks now. It looks so fresh. Just by one click, everything is looking so slick already. Here's a menu here. You know, here's your background picture and your title. You can easily change and customize everything here, like very simple. You can link your Spotify, your iTunes, your SoundCloud. Man, it's crazy. So I'm saying when they made this, they thought about, you know, they thought about the music producer or, or, and the artists. 
you know so some of the stuff here we don't need them you know because for for ba for making beats all you need is just a front page you know and a beat store and a couple of licenses you know and maybe i don't know maybe if you have like spotify or youtube instagram or whatever you can add that here so Alright, so now we can actually like edit this with you guys or show you guys how you can quickly edit this it's very simple actually you know if i'm on this page and i click see because if you are logged in as an like if you are logged into your wordpress when you're on a page you're gonna see this here this top bar here so since i'm on this page and i want to edit this page i click edit with elementor so look, look at how easy it is to like edit everything here. Yeah. So my name is Reggie Beats. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna edit this Beats here. Yeah. Just click on it, you know, and then you can change to Reggie Beats. And here on the side, you can change the style of it. If you click on it, it's gonna give you like a left panel. I can go to style. I can change the color. See text color. Okay, because I think now this is like gradient color, so I must remove the gradient color first. Enable gradient text, I just turn it off, you know, and then I go to uh, where's my text color again? No, it's here, text color. Can okay, I can choose any color, you know, now I can make it red, black, whatever, you know, blue, you know, you can make it any color you want to make it. I'll just make it blue because I kind of like blue, but even though it looks kind of funny now, but you know, let me just do it blue you know and i think i need to remove the i think it's the shadow text shadow you know because it i think it's red so let me just make it uh any color man i mean this is just for like demonstration purposes you know i can even remove it like i feel i don't think it's needed here so i can just actually remove it you know i think you remove it like that yeah so now here you know you can easily remove this as well because you need so many things so this one to remove it is, is easy you just click on that edit button here yeah. you right click on it and then you say delete now it's gone you know and i want to center this this rich beats snap click it then i go to advanced you know there's uh where is this? somewhere around here i just don't know where it is but i know it's here let me look for it uh here alignment you know now it's in the middle you know so you can do a lot of stuff you know so now we're gonna remove all this funky stuff here and then just gonna have a beat store so this is like a, it's like a section so you can delete this section by clicking that the section is gone i ruined this one as well we're gonna click this one as well because you don't need the instagram for now click delete see so now you can see we have the reggie beats here's my links and everything and then here oh it says official spotify playlist that's why i'm gonna add my beat stars uh my beat stars player you know so i can yeah i can just change this maybe let me remove this heading because one looks kind of funny delete that and then this one i can keep it but then i'll just type beat store you know say beat beat store that's it and then here so <clears throat> i'll also remove this because now i want to add a beat store here so i can just delete this as or right click delete as well so to add a beat store because a beat store is like all you need is like an iframe code you know so i need to go to my beat stars whether it's beat stars or it's uh you know a bit there's a lot of them but i like using beat stars you know so let me quickly go to my beat stars i'll be back in a in a minute no i mean like some of post the video so i'll be back now now if beat stars is simple you just log into your beat stars you go to the menu you go to players you know and then you'll get this page click on the edit button you know then you can see here you have the iframe you know iframe code for your the iframe code for the for your, for your beat store so i'm gonna copy this iframe code and then i go back to elemental to my website and i'm gonna you know i can remove this you know delete that and delete this as well so i can add like my beat store so i'm gonna search search for a widget here on the left side i'm gonna type text uh let me check i think it's html yes yeah, html 
I'm gonna click it. You can just click and drag. Look at it. It's simple. Very nice and simple. Click and drag. I can probably drag it somewhere here. Yeah, here in the middle. Perfect. So it's just okay now. Since I dragged it there, it says HTML code. Now I'm gonna paste the pitch stars code there. Then done. You're gonna see. I'm gonna get my B-Store out here, loaded, so it's loading my B-Store, voila, simple, <laughs> you know, it's crazy, very simple, now I'm done with that, I can just say update, alright, so let's see how it's looking now, you can see now it's like, uh, you know, can even roll all the way to the top, so Reggie B's, I know this color looks kind of funny though, I gotta change it, you know, scroll down, then here's my beat store. You know, it's just still loading now because I just saved it now. So it's loading. Here's my beat stores and my tracks and my playlists. You know, then I can I can buy my beat. So let's pick this website quickly. Let me exit the dashboard so I can see the website by itself. Alright, your minor drag is very slow. So but yeah, we'll get it. We'll get the so you go to my blog, that's the name of the website for now. Then you go to visit site. Okay, so here's Reggie Beats. You know, it's just the loading now, Reggie Beats. And I scroll down and here's my beat store here. You know, I can make it bigger if I want to. You know, here's my tracks. It looks so professional, you know, even this, you can edit everything, you know, that, you know, so take how simple it is, even the menu, you can edit that, you can edit everything, you can even add your SoundCloud to it, you know, you can add anything, as you can see, B-Store, that's how it is, it looks professional, just the blue there, you know, I gotta change that blue, you know, but then, yeah, that's how it is, because I'm not a designer, like, I just, you know, I don't, I'm not really like a graphic designer, but I know how to get things done, you know, so let's see, let's see maybe now I wanna, maybe let me add like a, what is it? Uh, but I mean like this is, you know, this is it actually. Because if you want other stuff to learn, let me know. Hit me up in the comments. If I wanna, let me show you how to like fix the menu. Cause you can see the menu has too many things. Cause this is still like demo content. So you must be able to get rid of this. So to get rid of this is very simple. Just click on uh, dashboard. Actually, it's menus, but I already clicked. Okay, let me click on menus right quick. Okay, it's too late. So you go to menus, you go to appearance and menus. You see, so these are the menus here. Here's home, about, music, everything. So if you don't want these sub menus there, just remove them. Remove and leave the main ones only sub menu remove you know because look at it now let me just say visit website oh snap now nah, nah, i'm opening a new tab so visit website but in a new tab oh shit look ah, i made it open like a whole new browser type of thing so you can see now that uh where is that mm, what am i looking for again uh snap akanda oh yeah see if you look at here The menus you see there's home example home example like home example so now if i remove all of that examples and i say save menu i right, still saving the menu now you see if i refresh this You can see my menu now it's just you know the home is doesn't have all those funny things there it's just one menu only these ones that are left but you can remove all of them you know so let me show you how to remove that background picture there so you can put your own picture you know so you go to uh i think as you go to customize
So here by site identity, you know, this is where you can put, I can put this like the title here at the top. I'll put like Reggie. Then here I can maybe like purchase beads, you know. Then now, let's see now, I want to change this background there, you know. So uh, let me click publish quick. So since I'm on this, then I close, let me quickly close it again. Okay, uh, let me just open that. Okay, since now I'm here. Hi, so now I want to edit this page, right? So I go to edit. So I want to edit like the background image there. I go to edit with Elementor. Yeah, so now I'll show you how to remove the background picture because of course you wouldn't want to put some other nigga with a beard on your website. So it's very simple. So we, all you gotta do is just just go to the top of the page, right click edit section. You know you should get this uh this uh panel on the side. Go to style. Okay, mine just taking long. I don't know why it's being so sluggish right now. Then you see as the picture, you can delete this picture because I'm going to delete it. You can either put a color, you know, let's say I can put like a white color there. Yeah, but white looks fine. You see, yeah, this looks, doesn't look that bad. It tries, you know. I can put a black one, you know, but I'll just put this. Then you can actually like, you can actually edit any section. Just click here, edit section. You can put a video in the background as you can see as well in the background as you can see so even this side i can say style you can see uh i think this is like the video the video that they have you see youtube video link snap maybe you can even put your beat here that's dope i don't know that but i, I just found something new as well so i can make it a classic you know go get a color you know make it red or whatever white you know you can do so many yeah i like white actually it looks kind of cool you know you can do so many things with it you know so it's very simple to edit it you can customize everything so i'm not gonna go through every little step because it's going to take so much time but then with what you have right now i feel like you can make your own website and if you have any questions don't hesitate man text you know connect i mean check on my i mean <laughs> if you have any questions just you know uh comment below i promise you i'll reply to you Take me, text me on Instagram, and if I miss do the whole website for you, let me know. You know, I can, I can, I can hook up a nice website for you as well. You know, we will we, we'll, we'll work it out. So yeah, man. If you, I mean, yeah. So I'm not gonna go through every little step here because this is too, it's too many things to do. So you'll just play with it yourself. You know, it's just as long as you can just click and drag things around, you'll be good, man. Yo. So, but if you have any questions, comment below. And thank you for watching, man. I appreciate that. All the links are below. All the step by step tutorials are below. So you'll never go wrong with this. Give it a try. Shout out to Sona because they killed.